Come on in to hear our story. Wait. Oh, all right. Mr. Echo. Mr. Awesome. I don't notice Mr. Echo. You just said awesome. Laugh if you can hear me. That's what I have to do to the elves, too, because they don't, they don't listen to their music. Why are you the next round? Okay. Hey, don't. What are you looking That's my neck period. Why is your neck period? I always get the best questions in this class. So it's the day before Thanksgiving, and all through the trees, the fall leaves are spinning aloft in the breeze. They're school bus with grins. And hopes of a field trip soon would begin. Now, has anybody been on a field trip before? Yeah. Ooh. Yes. Where do you think they might be going on their field trip? To a turkey farm. Ooh. Turkey farm. And what with their wondering eyes should they see but a miniature farm and eight tiny turkeys? <laughs> More rapid than chickens, as cockerels they came. He whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Ollie, now Stanley, now Larry and Mo, on Wally, on Beaver, on Shep and Groucho. So out through the barnyard, they ran and they flew, and they gobbled and giggled as friends sometimes do. You guys ever ran with turkeys? No. no. Chickens? No. no. Cousins? No. no. Yes. Oh, yeah. I do. Then somebody spotted an axe by the door. Boom, boom, boom. This could get scary, so you might want to look away. Okay. Tonight, said Mac Nugget. Oh, this is the kid's Nugget. These feathery beasts will be chopped up and roasted for Thanksgiving feast. The children stood still as tears filled their eyes. Then they clamored aloud in a chorus of cries. The matter. The children were calmer and mysteriously fatter. They put the turkey in there. The boys and girls drank up their drinks in the hay and thanked the old Mac Nugget and waddled away. You think you could stick a turkey under your shirt? No. They limped to the school bus, all huffing and puffing. It's not easy to walk with hot turkey stuffing. And then as the school bus drove off in the night, McNugget looked round, not a turkey in sight. The very next evening, eight families were blessed with eight fluffy Thanksgiving turkeys as guests. So each one gave thanks for love and for living, and they all had a wonderful, happy Thanksgiving.